and welcome back to another edition of Memescape News, the best source of information on the current happenings of the Memescape. I'm your host, Evan, and in continuing the tradition of alternating between incredibly long and incredibly short episodes, I am here bringing you coverage of a single new meme. So, let's get started. I am talking about one meme and one meme only, and that is, I slammed my penis in the car door. <laughs> oh man, I love the internet. So people have been making uh, gangster versions of classic cartoon characters in the form of art for some time now. This has kind of been a cultural phenomenon that has, it's existed for a few years now. Um, you look at the certain corners of the internet and you will find Gangster, Mickey Mouse, Gangster, um, Sylvester the Cat, you know, that kind of shit. So, of course, we have Gangster Daffy Duck. And as everybody knows about Daffy Duck, he's got a bit of a lisp. And so, um, <laughs> someone rapped him singing, well, rapped him... Uh, Someone made a, someone put a beat underneath one of the images of Gangster Daffy Duck and wrapped in his voice an impression, I slammed my penis in the car door. Uh, I slammed my penis in the car door. So of course some people thought this was very funny and someone made a version where he was with Parappa the Rappa. I slammed my penis in the car door. Slam your penis in the car door. And then someone animated it. I slam my penis in the car door. You slam your penis in the car door. So basically, now we have this video of Parappa the Rappa and Daffy Duck singing, I slammed my penis in the car door. No doubt, a masterpiece of modern meme culture, and people have kind of just been going wild making their own versions of this beautiful, beautiful video. I slammed my penis in the car door. You slam your penis in the car door. What? I didn't say I'd actually do that. It was just a slam joke. Slam your penis in the car door. What? Obviously not. Slam your penis in the car door. I'm just going to leave now. Then they do it for you. So if you can't tell by now, I'm a real big advocate of this one. I think it's just beautiful. I think this is a truly masterclass in meme creation, meme thought, Ho Chi meme theory. And I think that we should be sharing it with all the sorts of people who might be enjoying it, and I think it still has room to grow. Um, and no doubt it's going to end up melting into the massive pot of Among Us and Sus bullshit. Because that's just how meme culture works in 2021. Um, so no doubt we'll probably be seeing some form of that. Uh, <laughs> I hope this lasts a little longer. It is an ironic format, and they tend to last a little longer, but it's a little complicated. It's hard for me to say how long this is going to last, and right now I think it's currently in its peak. So if you're planning on investing, I would recommend doing that ASAP. Because if not, you might not get your returns proper, you know? But people are going to find this funny for a while, even after it loses some of its popularity. It's just a good format. <laughs> like, objectively. You know. You know how it is. 
And uh, finally for this week, this. Hey, Luigi! You playing Minecraft. I like it, cuz you. That's about it for this edition of Memescape News. There's gotta be shit I've missed, because this episode is so short. I talked about one goddamn thing. I bet there's more. There's gotta be more. But I don't know what it is. So if you know what it is, you can yell at me for forgetting about it right down there in the comments. And if I said something that's inaccurate, do that as well, and I'll mention it next time, because transparency is key in this ever-changing media climate. <laughs> If you want to be on the show, speaking of transparency, if you want to be on the show, let me know, hit me on Discord, and we will discuss it. I would love to have you on. If you have something interesting and related that you want to talk about, I'd love to have you join me. The more the merrier, and it's been quite a while since I've had other people do segments. So hit me up. I'd love it. That's about it. See you ladies and gents later.